What's up guys, John here. With the announcement of Season 3 and Overwatch ending soon, the rewards are coming your way as well. The rewards for the third Overwatch competitive season shouldn't come as a surprise. Players will be receiving a player icon, spray, and competitive points. According to an image Metabomb ripped from the PTR, this season's rewards are Velskaya themed. Competitive point rewards are tied to your seasonal rank, as was with Season 2, and you may spend them on Golden Weapon skins for whichever characters you choose. At the moment, Golden Weapons are the only reward you are able to spend points on. However, Overwatch's game director Jeff Kaplan stated that they would like to add some more rewards to the system. Unfortunately, the most dedicated competitive players may run into the competitive point cap. He said, new items are not going to happen at all for Season 3. Probably not for Season 4 either. And if you're active, you'll hit that 6,000 CP cap before we add new stuff. For most players, a golden weapon will signify their main character as each one costs a hefty 3,000 competitive points. Though, if you're a competitive Overwatch badass and been finishing each season in the higher tiers of play, you may already have the golden weapons for your favorite characters. If that's the case, you'll likely be aiming to collect other characters' golden guns you want to improve with or simply spending points so you aren't constantly capped out. In competitive fashion, players are rewarded in higher increments for a higher skill rating. Bronze players should receive about 100 points, while Grandmaster players should be receiving 3,000 points. This is the reward distribution for Overwatch Competitive Season 2. The point gains may change at Blizzard's discretion, but I doubt they will for Season 4. Every player should receive a spray and icon themed around Voskaya as a reward for competing in Overwatch's third season. The first competitive season rewards were designed around Illoys, while the second seasons were Route 66 centric. Season 4's reward theme should be marked when the Overwatch team releases their official announcement to highlight the end of Season 3 and further changes to the mode. In addition, players grinding into the Grandmaster ratings may want to push even harder before the season ends. Competitive players in the top 500 will receive rewards unique to the powerful few. Not only will the top 500 Overwatch players receive the unique player icon, they'll also be rewarded with an animated version of the Season 3 spray. Here's an example of the first season's animated spray. Every season's brought changes to Overwatch's competitive game mode, from reworking the skill ratings after Season 1 to adjusting the effect of placement matches after Season 2. The end of Season 3 should be no different. What changes would you like to see for Season 4? Let me know in the comments. And remember to like and share this video and subscribe to our channel to keep a lookout for all the changes coming in Season 4. You're watching Esports on PvP Live.